The Integrated Education Fund wanted to be involved in the Civic Innovation Programme as it was a perfect opportunity to enable voices that are usually not heard to become involved in some of the more democratic processes and planning education in their local environments. Well, look, our research at Ulster University um, has shown that there is a prevalence of small rural schools where you often have two schools in very close proximity to each other, but where perhaps both of those schools, or indeed one of those schools, is facing uh, issues around future sustainability and possibly potential closure. Uh, so the intention behind this project isn't to determine what should happen to those schools, but to give those communities the opportunity to have an input there say about what might happen. The Future Schools project is a great example where decisions about the closure of schools in a community did not engage parents, families and individuals from that local community. Now, thanks to the collaboration between Ulster University and the Integrated Education Fund, Future Schools Toolkit has been developed by the communities and this resource will be available as a mechanism for hearing people's voices around the impact of school closures. I suppose having a toolkit like this and a means in which we can engage and, and, and plan for the future is a really positive um, initiative and I think you know for, for parents they not only do they do they want and need toolkits and initiatives like this but they really value it and I think to be part of those conversations are really powerful when it comes to sort of long-term future planning for communities. This toolkit it really simplifies the process it saves hours and hours of searching online to try and find out what the, the next steps are and this lays it out very easily. So we've launched the toolkit and it's out there to really support schools, parents and communities that want to explore their options with regard to school provision in the area and to understand a bit more about how that, that can link in with the area planning process. Mm -hmm.